Kevin had assured me that North Country mules are very calm sheep, but when they came into the auction ring, there was some evidence to suggest they're not. Still, at least the auctioneer was easy to understand. By nodding occasionally, I seem to be buying stuff. And I was. Yes. At the end of the sale, I'd spent a whopping £11,000. But on the upside, I was now a sheep farmer. 40, 50, 60, 78. 78 sheep were there. Gentlemen? Hmm? Yes. People are examining the Yeah, they're, yeah the they're, organizers. they're the organizers. They're wondering. They're wondering about their carpet. Handcrafted by a renowned British atelier. Sympathetically marries the chassis of the yes. steam. Just Did you write? You that? hammered that bit onto it. that bit. The interior would benefit from some minor attention. Well, it yes, won't. with a hand grenade. Lot number 132. Soon the auction was underway. Ferrari 308 GTB at £118,000. Lot number 127. Start me with this at 300000 And many of the punters were happy to pay six-figure sums for the cars on offer. At 270000 285 for the Countach. Well, the contest just went for £285,000. I think I'm going to sell the uh, excellent for more than And then it was time. Moving on to lot number 138A. The excellent, oh. uh, fantastic, handcrafted, very unusual machine, as you can see. Don't want you with. A uh, beautiful, stylish Mercedes-Benz coachwork. Again, very unusual, unique and one-off motor car uh, here for sale this afternoon. Start me, if you will, on this at £425. At £425. Any advance at £400. £500. Pounds. £550 Somebody's anywhere. Paid. £550 here. £600 here. £650. £650. £700 now. Rattling at £650. Up. £700 anywhere. £700 here. £700. £800 now. Let's go for £1,000. £1,000 here. 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 £1,000 a thousand pounds here on my right. A thousand pounds. Fifteen hundred. Fifteen hundred here. Two thousand if you wish. It's two thousand and five. Two five. Three thousand now. It's three thousand here. Three five anywhere. Three one. <laughs> At three thousand one hundred. Three thousand two hundred pounds. At three thousand five hundred pounds. Four thousand. At four thousand pounds. At four thousand pounds anymore. At four thousand pounds, he comes to his offer. Thank you very much. He just lost ten 99. grand. He could have just thrown it down. The Jaguar Mark II. Start me on this, add if you will. Thirty thousand pounds anywhere? Thirty thousand? Twenty thousand then? Let's get going. Twenty thousand. We do, we do have a bit of a problem because that interview turned out to be a bit more lavish than we expected, and we are now completely broke. I mean, seriously, that's it. Every last penny is gone. We have. Zero money left. We've got to do some more filming. I've got to do some more cars and stuff. We can't do it. Well, I think we probably can. I've had a plan. There is nothing in the BBC guidelines that says we can't sell bits of the set to the audience. <laughs> so you're proposing yeah. we sell the set to pay for yes. making films? It's called ingenuity. How much, That's ladies weird. and gentlemen, am I bid for this calendar? This is a good Roundabouts idea. Roundabouts of Milton Keynes. <laughs> Who wants to start the bidding? I've got a bucket for the money. How much? Santa. Good grief. Uh, tell us like straight away. £10 <laughs> for the gentleman up. there. Any advance on £10 for this? No, yeah, that's £9 is going backwards. Jeremy, see? explain the theory. They're no, not the idea is, is that we sell it to the highest, highest. bidder. You need to bid more. I'm um, £10, I'm going to sell it once. I'm going to sell it twice. I'm selling it three times. I want to your money, though. I asked him, you've got to give us the money. Come on. Richard, if you could give him that. Thank there you very you go, much. Sir. Well done. Uh, oh, here's a good Come on, one. Go on, um, I want your money in here. Money. There we here's go. Here's a good one. Uh, we get Thank you very an much. Well done, astonishing sir. number of emails every week 
from people who adore him. It's honestly what? sheaf after sheaf, so we can auction a night out with you. Oh. <laughs> company, I smell a bit bad. No, this is, a, this is, can I give you an example of the kind of email that we get? And there are thousands of them. Uh, I think that Richard Hammond is gorgeous. Can we see more of him and not the other two? <laughs> Any chance of a signed photo? Love, Stuart. <laughs> modern man, you know, I'm comfortable Absolutely with that. Absolutely rubbish, you're right, let's not... Uh... No, I'm nobody oh, good. give me, where's that mini gone? Oh, that's round by my computer, look. Oh, yeah. Look. I, I, this is Who'll very give good. Us, who'll give us a quid for this? We modified that. It's, it's our hate thing in the office. If you get really cross, you can hit it. Give us a quid and we can do a some quid. telly. Thank you very much, you'll give us a quid. Thank you very much. How are give you doing? Give us a quid. Now, I reckon, I reckon... I've got about enough there to get started. Yeah? I think we can get some fuel. So, um, I'll, I'll, I'll take that yeah. and get going. You yeah. carry on auctioning and uh, I'll make a start. OK, fine. OK, the next bid, ladies and gentlemen. It's a Sony Digibeta broadcast quality <laughs> camera <laughs> with... Uh, no, you don't get the cameraman, sadly. It has a 5 millimetre... No, a 4.9 millimetre lens, I believe. How much am I bid for this? £120,000. <laughs> the Teesside Yesteryear Motor Club. How much do I not want to go out for dinner with anyone who's a member of that? Yeah, 68 Daimler. It's V8, but a tiny capacity, so busy little engine. And too expensive, unless it goes cheap. You never know. As the start time neared, we took our seats. This is the first time I've ever been to a car auction. It's fantastically exciting. Know, we could leave with anything. At auctions in the past, normally I'm the one at the back, drunk out of my mind, bidding for signed rugby balls. Those are charity auctions, aren't they? Ladies and gentlemen, uh, we will now get the first car in. Here we go, here we go, here we go. What is that? A London taxi. Lanchester, and our Lanchester, LJ2 1953, no documents, condition three. No documents. Where are you going to start with this one? 500 quickly. 500, 500, thank you, sir. 500 What are you doing? Let's get on with it. It's the first one. Yes, I'm doing what I used to do in nightclubs in Yorkshire. 700 I'm going over early. 800 You go and you get the first one you can. 1,000 bid 1,000. It's a car, I'm after it. 1,000 pounds. Give it to me. Thank you, sir. That's my you bought it? Yes, you the first one. Look at the back, one. No, Look at the back of it. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean, go ugly early? Because you go in. It's, I've been doing it in nightclubs. For you. When I was in Ripon, as a kid, brought it. You'd walk into the nightclub. First girl that's breathing in and out. Walk up to her. I love how you're doing. You're pulled. That's it. Job done. Your mates thinking, oh, in a minute, Ursula Andrews is going to turn up. And she did. We're stuck. The, Ford Cortina. the next lot was a tasty Ford Cortina. Hang on, hang on. On my right, 220, 220, 40, 240, 60, 60, 80, 280, 280, 300, 320, 320, 320, 320, 320, 320, 320, 320, 320, 320, 320, 320, 320, 320, 320, 320, 320, 320, 320, what the hell's this? It's an Austin 7. I'm not interested. Then, finally, a convertible arrived. Hang on. And Top Gear's auction new boy went mad. 25, 26, 29, 29, 3,000 a bead, 3,000, 3,000, 3,1, 3,2. You're making a mistake. What are you thinking? 3,4, 3,5, 3,6, 3,6. Yes. 222. <laughs> Have you thought? <laughs> You bought that! <laughs> How much have I paid for it? 3,600. So I've got over 600 of my own money in this. Yes, yes, sir. Oh my god, what have I done? Auctioneer, ladies and gentlemen, would you please welcome broadcaster, author, and journalist, and all round top banana, Favourite lots, then? Do, any spring to mind? It's always the dung. Every single year, somebody donates however many tonnes of dung that I then have to auction. Who'll give me £7.50, ladies and gentlemen? £7.75, £7.80, £7.85. And you think, time is ticking away here. But each 5p, 
is worth having. So it's it's worth pushing. In the olden days when I used to work for the BBC, you couldn't say shit. <laughs> but I don't anymore, so it's a load of shit. It's a ton, in fact, of shit. Remember in the olden days, there used to be a television programme called Top Gear. Which was on the BBC. <laughs> It'll be back to somewhere else. <laughs> or maybe even not somewhere else, who knows? Anyway, this could be, this is the important thing, your last chance to acquire an official Top Gear Kung Fu stick t-shirt signed by a former presenter. <laughs> well, at least he'd done something. Unlike James, who as car after car went by, Bid. No. still refused to buy. You will see my patience will be rewarded. Spitfire Sports. Come on, James, you want a Spitfire? No, I don't. James, it's in budget. You like the colour. Bid. Bid. James was being so stubborn, I decided to bid on his behalf. 1450. 1500. <laughs> Have you, did you just bid on that, you yeah. half wit? With that. Your number. <laughs> <laughs> James, I'm warning you, if you don't buy something in a minute... This is mine. It's a Bristol's, but it's got the wrong engine, so it's not worth much. Watch this. Someone start me 5,000 to get me away, 5,000 bit. At 5'2", 5'4", 5'6". That's new stuff then, isn't it? We're out. We're out. We're out. Six, two, six, four. I wanted that. 6'8", 7,000. So, Captain Cautious, what are you going to do now? Um, you're all starting now to look like you're in trouble. You are. There's Sorry plenty more stuff coming through. What? Ladies and gentlemen, we're now coming up to the last lot. The very what? last lot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 mate. No, it's... It'll look good. It's nice. I don't want that. Seriously, what do we do? Because I don't want the Citroen. I don't want it. 550, 600, 700 a minute, 700, 700, 700, 750, 800 a minute. You've got no choice. You've got no choice. 900 quid. 150, 1,050, 1,100, 1,150, 1,150, 1,200. Oh, God. You've got to buy it, mate. 1,450, 1,450, 1,450. It's a lovely colour. 1,450, 1,500, 1,500, 1,500. Nice. Oh, yes. Worth every penny. Sorry. There you go. Oh, I can hide here. First of which is lot number 590. 590. The Porsche 911T. Right then, ladies and gentlemen, we're straight in. 20,000, 22, 24, 26. I can't stop it. It's 40,000 here. One if it helps you. 41,000, 42. He's stealing it. He's stealing it. Soon the field started to fill up and the auction buzz was building. He's just showing off. Look at me. Still got an arm. Amazon have said they want as much diversity in this show as we can possibly manage. And I think we're doing well because if you look, there's every different type of white 60-year-old men here. Right, we have a great lineup of arable kit and grassland kit. To make sure I didn't rip myself off, Charlie had also provided a handy price guide for each bit of kit. I need lot three here. Good price would be six and a half. Bad price would be 13. So, Merlin CLM cultivator, at £1,000 the CLM. At £1,000 I'm bid. £1, Under the watchful gaze of a man who seemed to have had an argument with a threshing machine, I started bidding. 14, 16, 1800 I'm bid, 2000 I'm bid, 22, 24, at 26, 32, at 33, at 38, 3850. Your bid, sir, 611. Six Thank you. One. Thank you. That was good. You see, we were told six and a half thousand was a good price. We've just got that for three nine fifty. On we go, lot thirty three. It's a Bomford double seven hedge cutter, two thousand nine bid. I did go a bit over on some of my other purchases. Your bid, sir. That's okay, so I was told not to go above three thousand six hundred, and I've gone to five thousand one hundred. Here we go then. 
bid's on there. But at the end of the sale... At 4-2 I'm bid. At 2006. I had everything I needed. Your bid, sir. 6-11, the buyer. 